The event that uh, you do find somebody in the car, uh, it's probably a robbery or assault type of scenario. Uh, if it's simply a robbery scenario, again, the key words are comply, comply, comply. You are nearly defenseless in your front seat if someone attacks from behind. Nearly, but not always. City Commando is brought to you in part by a magazine, the best magazine for men. Warning, the stunts and techniques performed in these situations are performed by professionals. Do not try these without proper training. Cyrus had cash on his mind when he planned the attack on Biko, the owner of the catering trucks. His profits from the week were the target, but in this case, violence was, for Cyrus, an added bonus. When you train with the Russian armed forces, a certain air of confidence surrounds you, as it does with Mikhail Volman, who came to North America via Uzbekistan, a breakaway republic from the old USSR. And I was in the military, obviously, just like many other Russian uh, people who came from, from those times. I served in a special unit, and um, I wish I knew a little bit more about Sistema at that time. Volman trained in many of the martial arts before he found Vasiliev, the renowned practitioner of Sistema. Well, before, before Sistema, before taking Sistema, I have experience of about 18 years in boxing. That's in former Soviet Union. I boxed professionally. With over 10 years of training with one of the arts masters, Misha Volman opened his own school in a gritty steel town full of potential. His legendary grit and determinations make him a natural city commando. In this scenario, his victim trapped in a car and a assailant is trying to wrap uh, the seat belt of the victim around his neck and choke him. And this is how city commando is going to help him. Step one, drive elbow to chin. As a system practitioner you have to relax yourself completely shift to the opposite side which allows you which gives you a little more space to bring your head, hand up and the elbow goes right into the assailant's chin so you exhale relax and move shift to the side away from the attacker by doing that you release and and uh, give yourself some space for the elbow and the shoulder to go up that allows your, sh your elbow to hit the attacker right in the face or the jaw or uh, teeth the assailant is attacking the driver and holds the power. The minute the driver strikes a blow to the assailant's central nervous system, that nervous system has to then make its own decision of whether it's gonna fight further or whether it's gonna play possum. Step two, strike arm and grab head. And the same elbow you bring down, bring assailant closer to yourself with your two hands you grab him by, by his ears and by the head and bring him forward straight into the, into the steering wheel. And here he's gonna be under your complete control. With that, the same elbow, you can, you can lower that elbow and, and hit attacker's forearm, which will bring the attacker at the same time closer to you and will allow you to grab him by the ears or by the head and drive him all the way into the steering wheel or between your legs. Here you can either apply a choke or can squeeze his head right up against the steering wheel, and that will disable the attacker. By having the neck twisted, you're delivering shearing forces across the brain. This is how concussion injuries occur. With enough force, this can produce a concussion. That effectively gives you the upper hand. The assailant is, is using seat belt and he's trying to choke you. What you have to do is relax the shoulder, which you think is 
is being jammed by the seat belt. Relax your shoulder more. Body a little bit to, to the opposite side. Drive your elbow up into the air, right into assailant's chin. You, you grab with one hand his hand, and the same elbow goes right into his muscle in the forearm, which also brings his body closer to the steering wheel, which at the same time brings him closer because the second hand is being used now. With two hands, you can bring him right into the, into the steering wheel and disable the assailant that way. You can hold him down there as long as you want. When you can't walk away, the City Commando way.